here in the United States. It's becoming increasingly aware to me, and it probably is to you, that we believers who stand up for the Lord are more and more treated like the Jews were treated in Germany at the time Hitler was coming to power. They were marked. They were isolated. They were limited. They were made the object of derision and hatred, the symbol of everything dangerous and of everything that impeded the way of progress in a new nation that was under construction. We live in the post-Christian era in America. The deconstruction has taken place. The new construction of a heathen pagan nation is taking place. And believers who are a part of what has been destroyed are looked upon with great suspicion and great hatred. We are marked. We suffer opprobrium. We are ridiculed. We're lied about. We're slandered. We're made to appear evil and threatening to the populace at large. And so this hatred grows and grows. This derision grows and grows. The editorials increase against the Christian believer and the Bible-believing church and the Christian school. And uh, after a while, it's just like the Jews were in Germany under Hitler and in surrounding countries like Poland. When Germany took over these nations, they were marked for death and extinction. They were lied about. The general populace was made to fear them and consider them a threat. And so the populace got behind the government in snuffing them out, if possible. Are you ready for this? To be hated for His sake? You better be. 